Welcome to Style Studio again. Hope you're ready to get a little burn on. We've got a full body, 20 minute workout. It's a boot camp that basically involves just having two or three pieces of equipment. The first piece of equipment you want are two paper plates. If you don't have paper plates, it's okay to have two sheets of paper. Just make sure you're on a smooth surface, so stay away from carpeted areas. Try to be on a wood floor or tile floor. The second thing you want is a couch right here. I'm sure you have a couch or a, like a big chair. And then finally, the last thing you want are either two hand weights, or I have two cans of chili right here, just two cans to actually do some exercises with, or a pillow. You can do the same thing with the pillow. So these are all one minute long, okay? And we're gonna do 10 exercises for one minute each, which is a total of 10 minutes. We're gonna take a one minute break and then we're gonna go back through it again. So get ready to get our burn on. You guys ready? All right, here we go. First thing we're doing is tricep dips. You're gonna go to the couch, put your hands at the end of the couch, bring your feet out so that your butt is far away from the end of the couch. And all you're gonna do is keeping your legs straight and your toes up, you're gonna go down to 90 degrees. I'm gonna go down to 90 and bring it back up again. Down to 90, bring it back up. So it's like you're sitting down, almost sitting down on the floor, but you're keeping it going. So that you're feeling the triceps burn. And stay solid. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Feel those triceps burn. It's not about speed, it's about just doing them the right way so that you feel the burn on each repetition. Stay strong. Come on, stay with me on these. I know these burn right now. Come on, work through these. The next thing we're gonna do is bicep curl and military. So get ready to get some equipment. So here we go. Okay, grab your equipment. You can either do bicep curls and militaries with sitting on the end of the couch with two cans or two hand weights. Curl up to your shoulders, bring it up and rotate your hands so that your thumbs are pointing towards each other and bring it back down again, keeping your elbows tight. So it's bicep curls into militaries with hand weights or cans, or you can use a pillow. So if you're using a pillow, you're coming both hands on one side, each side of the pillow, thumbs on the inside, fingers on the outside. You curl up, push up. And if you're using a pillow, try to do fast repetitions so you're actually getting a workout in, because it's not heavy. It's just repetition and getting those muscles warm. So we're working biceps and deltoids right here. So bicep curls into deltoids, pushing those arms up on the militaries, and keep going. You got this. That's it, stay strong now, stay strong. Okay, that was a minute. So now we're gonna do side adduction. So this is the way it's gonna look like. You're gonna put your leg onto, and I'm gonna grab a pillow right here for the ground, because I don't like my elbow being on the ground. So I'm going to put my elbow onto the pillow, Okay, and get into a side plank, elbow bent. Bring the other leg, one leg on top leg, sideways, side plank. So you're in a side plank, except this bottom leg's on the ground. And we're just gonna lift it off the ground for about 20 seconds. And then we're gonna switch to the other side. Hang in there, come on, hang in there. And switching to the other side. Bring it over to the other side. Same thing, leg straight, elbow in. Um, keeping the elbow at 90 degrees, bring the foot off the ground, bottom leg off the ground, hold. This you're working your abductor, which is the inside of your leg. So hold onto it, and the adductor. So hold, hold, hold. All right, nice. And go ahead and get ready for the next exercise. Next exercise is going to be couch decline push-ups. So this is the way it's gonna look like. We're gonna put our feet at the end of the couch, push up high position. So you're in a push up high position and all you're going to do is do push ups to 90 degrees if you can and letting your elbows come down, come back up. If you need to adjust it and you want to do military style, that's fine. Just don't hit your head on the ground. Come back down and just keep going. Stay strong. Tighten up the abs. Tighten up the legs. Keep your core tight. You feel this on the deltoids, the triceps and the pectorals. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. These are the hardest ones today, so hang in there. If you have to slow it down, slow it down. 
quality rather than trying to do them halfway. You don't want to be doing this. You want to go all the way down, come all the way back up. If you're a beginner, it's okay to go halfway down if you need to. But try to work these as much as you can. And next exercise are the eyes. So this is the way it's going to look like. I'm going to go sideways and dangle like this. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to put my hands to the side of my legs, palms on the side of my thighs. You're going to lift up. So palms are facing each other. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Push your hands together and back down. So it's up, squeeze, down. This is working the rhomboids. Up, squeeze. This is good for your posture. For those of you guys that slouch, your upper back is always slouching. These muscles are the ones we always forget. And then just speed it up. So it's up, squeeze, back down. And once you have the hang of it, all you should be doing is bringing it up and squeezing. Squeezing shoulder blades together. Pretend like there's a ball between your shoulder blades and you're trying to keep it together. Squeezing it together and letting go. Squeezing it together and letting go. Keep going. Keep going. You should be breaking a sweat. Keep going. Keep going. Keep squeezing. You're feeling the rhomboids on your back. All right. Awesome. Next one is calf raises. So you're going to bend in your waist. Put your hands flat onto the side of the couch. All you do is lifting your, ups, your heels off the ground and bringing it back down again. So you're putting your weight on the balls of your feet. Keeping your back flat. All you're doing is raising up those heels, getting the gastric nemeus or the calf muscles to work. And keep going. Stay strong. Feel the actual exercise, the burn in the calf muscle. Keep strong on these. The, your hands are just on the couch to support you so you don't fall over. But what you're doing is hinging at the hips and you're putting all that weight back. Most of your leg weight is actually being lifted by your gastrocnemius right now. Hang in there, you're feeling the burn of the gastrocnemius. That's it. Stay strong, stay strong. Come on, you got this, you got this. You got this. Okay, next one. Grab your paper plates. When you grab a pair of plates, reverse crab walk. So reverse plank crab walk. Put your heels onto the paper plates. Put your hands behind you. Bring yourself in a crab position and then just extend out. So bring it down, extend out. So it's crab position like a reverse bridge and, and just kick it out. Reverse bridge, kick it out. So crab position. Kick it up. Crab position, kick it up. That's it. Try to bring your hips high on these. You're feeling the triceps burn on these, and you're feeling the glutes burn, and you're actually feeling your hamstrings burn on these because you're tightening up that bridge. Keep your heels only onto the paper plates. That way you can slide up. Keep going, keep going. One more exercise for round one. Hang in there. Okay, next one. You're going to go ahead and put your feet onto the plates and step it back behind you for the pipes. So you're going to go here, put your feet in the center of the plates. You're going to push up high position like this, and all you're going to do is tuck it in and then bring it back out again. So push up high. Tuck it in, bring it in. So you want to make sure that your back is flat and push up high. So you're not letting yourself drop down and sag your waist. You don't want to be sagging like this, right? You want to keep your core tight in this position so you should be in a diagonal when you're doing these. So here we go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Flat back, flat back. Keep going, keep going. Come on, only one minute of these. And then we're done with our first round. Hang in there. These are called pikes. Less than 10 seconds. Okay, get rid of the paper plates. One minute of rest. So go ahead and stretch those muscles, any muscles you need to stretch. I'm gonna stretch my triceps. Feeling the tricep stretch, because on those push-ups, those decline push-ups, I could feel the burn on my triceps. Your triceps are right here, right? Feeling the stretch. 
I'm gonna stretch my gastrocnemius, my calf muscles. So I'm gonna reach down, pull up on my toes, and bring it back down again. Feeling that stretch, loosening them up. And then the other side. I'm gonna stretch my hamstrings. So I'm gonna go from half fold to full fold, letting my head drop down, hands on your thighs, flat back, looking forward, half fold, full fold. I'm gonna stretch this. Now get ready for round two. We're gonna do tricep dips on the couch in a few seconds. Keep stretching. Oh, there we go. Okay, round two, here we go, ready. And let's take it away. Tricep dips, hands at the end of the couch. Go ahead and bring yourself down to 90 degrees and back up again. Come on, stay strong, keep breathing, keep breathing, stay with me. You made it through the first round, I know you're tired, but so what? Look at what you're gaining from this. Muscular strength and conditioning, come on, stay strong. Getting your heart rate up as well, so you're getting a little bit of cardiovascular conditioning in this because you're moving continuously and you're not letting yourself stop. 20 minute workout, keep going. Nice job, stay strong, stay strong. You should be breaking a sweat already. If you're not, you're not working hard enough, so work hard on these. Don't let your butt touch the ground if you can prevent it. Don't let that, touch, that, that butt touch the ground. Keep breathing. Exhale on the way up. Nice job. All right, going to bicep curls. I'm gonna use the pillow because the pillow feels actually a little heavier than those little baby cans. If you have hand weights, go for it. Put my legs out, get the paper plates out of the way, and boom, bicep curls up, military. And keep it going, bicep curls up, military. Bicep curls up, military. That's it, stay strong now. Never thought you'd be weightlifting with a pillow, huh? But if you're doing it fast, you're still feeling the burn because what's happening is, is that motion, especially raising your hands above your head, you're feeling your deltoids and your traps working. So keep it going. Keep going and stop on me. You want your heart rate to stay up. You want to be breathing hard. You want to be breaking a sweat. So stay strong on these. Not very long left, less than 10 seconds. Get ready for adduction side bridges. All right, get rid of that pillow. Adduction side bridge, here we go. I'm gonna get this pillow underneath my elbow because I like the comfort of my elbow being on a pillow. Side plank, hold it for 20. And you pull yourself further away and hold it. Remember the bottom leg, notice, is off the ground with the knee bent. My hand's up here, the leg is straight. You're holding yourself in a side plank. Hang in there. And less than 30 seconds, we're switching to the other side. Elbow bent, 90 degrees. Put the other leg on top, bend the knee and hold it. Try to keep the leg straight, side plank. Keep going, keep going, hang in there. Remember, this knee is bent and off the ground. This one's holding you up, you're working the abductor. Less than 10 seconds. Hang in there. And yes. All right, done with that one. Now we're gonna go to couch decline push-ups. Your favorite and mine. Get the feet onto the ground, onto the edge of the couch, and then bring your hands on the ground. Bring them narrow or wide, depending on how comfortable you are. I like going narrow on these. And then you're just gonna bring yourself down and back up. Down and back up. Tighten up your core. Tighten up those muscles. Down and back up. Keeping the muscles tight. Keep breathing. If you need to take a break and stop at the top for a second, go ahead and do that, but power through these as long as you can. Second time around is harder reps. I'm dying right here, but hang in there. 
Hey, one more, one more, one more, one more. Okay. Next one, eyes on the couch. Lay on the couch, on your stomach. Okay, bringing yourself in this position right here. Hands on the side of your legs. Legs straight, back straight. Good and break, relax your chin. It's up, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Up, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. And keep going. Remember, don't try to squeeze your hands together first. Squeeze your shoulder blades together, and then your hands will come together as a result. Not close together, but towards each other, right? Your palms are facing each other, and you're squeezing those shoulder blades together, feeling the rhomboids working. Keep going. Come on, we only have four more exercises. You got this, you made it through this far. Are you feeling the burn? I know you are. Come on, stay with me on these. Keep going, keep going. That's it, stay strong. Keep squeezing those shoulder blades together. Squeeze them together. And going straight to calf raises. All right, hands to the edge of the couch, feet shoulders apart, bend your hips, flat back, and raise it up. Come on, drive those heels off the ground. Tighten up your abs, keep your back tight. Try not to let your body just lean forward. You wanna keep everything tight right here so that you're actually not really pushing off the couch. All you're doing is lifting your heels off the ground, working the gastrocnemius. Come on, you guys got this. We only have three more exercises and then we are done with a 20 minute solid full body couch and paper plate workout. Stay with me on these. Get ready for the paper plates next. We're gonna be doing the actual crab reverse. Keep going. Get ready for crab reverse planks. All right, here we go, crab reverse planks. Put your feet onto the paper plates. And we're gonna be in the crab position right here. Then we're gonna kick it out. Crab, kick out. Crab, kick out. So go into a reverse bridge, right? So this is a bridge right here, tighten it up, and then kick it out. Bridge, 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 kick it out. Keep going. Keep going, come on. Tighten up that core as you come up. Get ready for pikes. And after pikes, this second round, we're gonna add one more bonus exercise because you're feeling good. Okay, pikes, feet onto the paper plates. Push up high, boom, push up high, ready? Boom, bring it up, come on, bring it up. And back out to push up high, bring it up. Back to push up high, bring it up. Back to push up high, bring it up. Back to push up high, that's it, keep it going. Stay solid, stay solid. Stay solid. That's it. So we only did nine exercises the first round. We did a one minute break, that was 10 minutes. This last round, we don't have a one minute break because we're gonna be done. So we're gonna do 10 exercises. So after these pikes, after we're done on these, we're gonna go to mountain climbers. So here we go. Ready? One minute of mountain climbers. Hands shoulder width apart, and bring the feet up between the legs, or between the arms. Bring the feet up between the arms. And switch, 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 switch. Keep bringing those knees up nice and high. Come on, slide them up, slide them up. Bring the knees up between the arms, not outside the arms. Knees that come up between the arms. Nice and narrow on these. Come on, stay tough. This is the bonus exercise. 
exercise. Stay tough. Switch those legs at the same time. Come on, you got this. You got this. Stay with me. Stay with me. Come on, you got this. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Working hip flexors. Working quads. Working the core. Your triceps are burning. And that's it. All right. One minute of cool down exercises. So that was 19 minutes of working out, right? And then let's go to half fold, full fold, half fold, full fold. So nine minute workout, one minute break, 10 minute workout with a one minute stretch down now. Stretching the triceps, the deltoids, tricep stretch. Oh, that should feel good after all those push ups. Tricep. Tricep and deltoid. Reach it up. Stretch side to side. Sit at the edge of your couch. Reach down to your toes. Pull up on your toes on one foot. Stretch in the calf muscle, gastrocnemius. Pull up on the other foot. Stretch in the gastrocnemius. And that's it. Thank you for joining Style Studio Couch and Paper Plate Workout. Hope you had a great workout. Hope you actually challenged some muscles and you got your heart rate up. And most important, that you stepped in the challenge zone and you gained something from it. Don't forget, stay fit, stay healthy, stay strong. Have a great day.